In this video, we're going to be unboxing a package that I just received, which is the Burke Red Just Men's Shoes. So I'm going to be opening this up for the first time today. So let's get me get my trusty scissors out. All right, got the box open, and I'm immediately noticing something that disappoints me. I can see there's a dent here. There's a dent right here as well. Let's see anywhere else. Looks like there's some dents on the bottom here. This is dented a bit. Uh, you know, quite frankly, the box could be in better shape. Much better shape, really. Although these are from China, so I guess I'm not too, um, you know, concerned. In the actual packaging for the shoes, it kind of looks like standard shoe packaging right now, which is not really a bad thing. Uh, yes, you'll notice these shoes are not very safe. They're quite um, colorful. But I did that on purpose because I like taking risks. You know, they, they have the packing inside, which is great. Let's see if there's any damage on the shoes themselves since the box was so, um, you know, not in good shape. And one thing I do notice actually is I've bought fairly cheap shoes before for like 80 bucks or so on Amazon.com and I've noticed that they're usually stiff as a board, the one on, the ones on Amazon that is. This is actually pretty soft. I actually like how this feels. It feels like it would be comfortable to wear actually, um, which is a very surprising uh, good thing because I only paid about 80 bucks for these which is pretty cheap. I didn't notice any problems with that shoe. Let's see about this one. Is that a scuff mark? Uh, it might be a scuff mark there actually. Yeah, it is. A little scuff mark right there. I don't know if that would buff out or not. I mean, they are cheap shoes, so I guess I can't complain too much, but not, I'm not a fan of the scuff mark. I mean, given the condition the box was in, I guess I'm not surprised, but other than that little scuff mark, it really doesn't look bad. And, um, yeah, I mean, I, I, may, I am pleasantly surprised by how flexible the shoes are. I must say, it feels like they're going to be comfortable to wear. These are from Just Men's website. They're the Burke Red uh, dress shoes. I have a link in the description to them. Um, yeah, made in China, but they look like they are supposed to look. The product description, it, it's accurate, I would say. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm not surprised by how they look at all. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go try these on next to see how that works out. Okay, so this is the first time I'm going to be trying these on. Uh, do forgive me for my floor being ugly. I have to replace the tiles. They're quite old. Let me find the laces. Hopefully you can see what I'm doing with the camera. I'm just looking for the laces, nothing special. Uh, Scooby-Doo mystery here. Well, I found it. It's buried way in there. Okay, so I got the laces out on this one here. Let's just see if it goes in easily or if it's a total struggle or if it fits properly let's let's see all that if it's comfortable well, let's see so far i'm going to say this is like standard you know dress shoes stuff it's they're not easy to get into but that's nothing special okay well i am in let's tighten these back up all right that one is on. Let's go and figure out this other one. Uh, I say that the fit is fine. I have no issues with the fit. I ordered a size 11 and it feels like a size 11. I'm not the biggest fan of the, the room and the toe box. I really don't like the shoes when they're pointy. But, I mean, I knew they were going to be tight in the toe box when I got them. And it's very difficult to get shoes that aren't uh, tight in the toe box, uh, just sadly. But other than the fact that the toe box is, is tight, they are comfortable. I mean, I'm not going to want to wear these all day or anything just because they're not good for your toes with how pointy they are. Yeah, I, like, I have wide feet. But, like... You know, they're, they are pretty, they are comfortable. Um, walking, stepping back and forth, it feels fine. Okay, so I could definitely say after trying them on, after walking around the house a little bit with them, they are fairly comfortable except for the toe box being tight. 
I'm not going to want to wear them all day just because I do not like tight toe boxes. I don't want my, my big toe being pushed over at an angle. It's not good for your feet and I don't like it when shoe manufacturers make their shoes like that. But with dress shoes, pretty much all of them do, so you really don't have much of a choice. Other than that, they're very comfortable. They're soft. Um, they're easy to walk in. They're easy enough to get on and off. I really didn't have too much trouble compared to regular shoes. Uh, the link is in the video description. They're $80, actually slightly less. So I do recommend them. I, I think they look good. I, they feel good. They feel like they're pretty good quality, uh, other than the one scuff mark on the shoe itself. They were just fine in the package, even though the package was beat up. So if you're looking for cheap shoes that are pretty good quality, then I would say these are definitely a go. Link in the description. Check it out, and I'll see you next time.